How big do you okay, want me to? Okay. I can I can get bigger. You want me to get bigger? You don't have How to big get you... bigger. <laughs> no, but I can get I can get real big. Watch this. Oh my god. You know that oh my god. Do an improved donk. I gave it's, him the uh, scale ability. Damn. It's, it's <laughs> over over two hundred percent more donk in your daily activities. And look at this. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, you gotta... Oh my god. Oh. Yeah, right, I'll go back. I'll go back down. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> there you go. Yay, you're still All big. Right. You're so big. <laughs> <laughs> All right, is that too big? I'm still too big. Let me make myself a little bit little. All right, how's that? Is that the right size donk? Is that what you want? Yeah, that's great. This is more accurate to our real world proportions now. <laughs> for sure. Um, guess what we have for today? Are you guessing? Uh, are you asking me it, or chat? Is it is it what's in the in the notification, the, the title <laughs> and the go live notification, maybe? Was it was it the thing it was the thing that you sent everybody and said today this is what we're doing on the stream? Yes. Could be. Yes. Well, cool. then I'm gonna make an educated guess that we're gonna see some cool loot from yes. Comic Con. Look, 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 we're, we're going to get ready. Whoa, look, it's an IRL cam. Did you remember What's to put your pants on, Reggie? What's going in, Well, I have the Comic-Con exclusive uh, dick sock on today. Dick sock? What the fuck is You know, it's nice. The cockadile? The, <sighs> the, the, cock, the cock sock, I should the say. Oh, the cockadile? Is that a thing? Is that a real thing? Cock sock. Oh, cock socks? Absolutely. Really? What do you use it for? Just in case. You put your <laughs> cock in it. Yeah, just in case you gotta, you know, you, just in case you gotta be presentable when you get to the door, when the pack, when when like the mailman comes or something. Yeah, or maybe you're you're the, you're very sensitive, like you have a very sensitive shaft to temperature. <laughs> yeah, but the yeah, rest of yeah, you yeah, gets like very, this. but the rest of you gets really hot, like you get like hot buns, but cock you got sock. cold shaft. You gotta get a cock sock just to keep that puppy. Hey. Keep it, keep it uh, moving. It's, it's see, Purakami knows it's more of a winter wear. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody wants to get right. um, a frost bit on the tip. So, so yep, we have. Right dun, 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 dun. Why is it sideways? Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh, it's the reveal. Oh it's Reggie. the reveal. <laughs> 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 These are Rick and Morty acrylic buttons. Do you want me to do Comic -Con this? Comic-Con exclusive. Yep. Uh, 2018 debut, as you can see. It says right there. Can you hold it closer to the camera? We, so we can't can see, see it. Right. it. Oh, 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 nice. Nice. Ooh. Is that a, is that a, are those, are those buttons made of metal? Is that a metal plumbus? No, I think this is all acrylic, uh, ah. nothing metal. I wish they were metal, but that's them. It is a fine looking plumbus. I don't. I, I feel like the there that there's a couple of those in there that like could be better served by other iconic Rick and Morty imagery, like the yeah. yellow little yellow symbol thingy down at the bottom. I feel like in three seasons of Rick and Morty, there's exponentially more cool shit than that to make out of a button. But I do approve of the pickle. Yes, the pickle I do, is I do important. Pick, I do I do approve of the plumbus. Okay, okay. But right. uh yeah. Yeah, cool. That's one. Right on, right on. So there was this artist that we came across his booth. His name is Justin Orr. And he had some really cool art that stuck out to me. So look at this is we bought a couple of pieces from him. Look at that. Oh, adorable. It, yeah, that's pretty rad. Yeah, this is cool. I like that. That's Pickle cool. Rick. There he is. That's that's him. Being a pickle. <laughs> Go on. This is a Stranger Things. Uh, let me see if I can move it. But this is actually a Stranger Things from the same artist, Stranger Things poster. I like it. I like the guy's style. Yeah, he's got some cool shit. So that's that's another piece. Next. All right. Next. 
she says next. She says next, like she wasn't the one that uh purchased these. I, I like it. I like it. Um, and then we go into the Voltron. The Voltron. Dun, 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 dun. Defenders Rad. of the Universe. It's got that Metro. It's got that Metro style like movie poster look. Mm-hmm. I like it, like the little gradient stuff. Yep. Is this the same guy still? Yeah, it's still the same guy. We're going through all, cool. all his all his shit first. I like it. I like that one. Yeah, that one's cool. But that's the art. Oh, and I see the little I see the little dragony guy down there in the bottom that you have the other print from over there in the bottom left by Reggie's head. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, so I saw yeah. you had the I saw you had that one as well. Well those little prints, those little prints were actually free. Free ninety nine. Oh. Well these free. are probably really hard to autofocus because they got like the the fucking swirls in them. Well, I'll do that one first. There he is. There all she right, goes. All right, all right. And then, and then that guy. Okay, there he is. Okay, okay. There she is. Oh, nice. You got some, that, that Bob Bergesa. Well, yes, yes. well, we have a story about how we won those pins. We met someone at a party that was, you Cloak know, the. And dagger. Are you going to just interrupt me? Just show the pins and put them down, and I'll tell them that. We won them in a game. <laughs> oh, man. oh no! Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, we were at a little <laughs> man. Meet. Get cut. Get Black cut. Lightning. Oh my god! Get we, cut. We... Black lightning pin. Talk, sh talk shit. No, get hit. no. Keep going, Chewie. Keep going. We we were at a little Joker. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Did you did you want to speak? Wait. Okay. Go ahead. <laughs> no, no. I I have to open this one up. So this one, this one's gonna take a little bit. So so go ahead and finish what you're saying. Oh uh, my goodness! All right, you you tell us about the story. You know the heads up game. Comic Con exclusive. Pin. This one's really cool though. Cause a little bit further away. Camera. Yeah, there you go. Nice. So keep going. Bam, bam, bam. What are you waiting for? Um, for Reggie to shut up. <laughs> um, for Reggie to shut up. I hate you so much. <laughs> you know, I'm just uh waiting for Reggie to shut up. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Sitting here just waiting for Reggie to shut up. Oh my God! Do I sound like Oh, now like we need droopy? to invent. Now we need. Now we need to get another character. We need to make a new cartoon character that Reggie can voice with his Chewie impersonation. Uh, we'll call her Dewey. We'll call her Dewey. Yeah, I like these things. Oh, Move man. that a little bit closer, Rich. Just a little bit. Nice, nice. So this artist's cool. name is uh, Chet Phillips. We bought a few. Th those were only ten dollars. So it's like, and they were, they have those yeah, little that's... matte things. I thought they were good. Yeah, no, the that's cool. The level of detail is pretty awesome. Go Red, on. I like that a lot. I like that. That's cool. Then we have another one. King! Die Hard. Die Hard is always good. <laughs> That's not the best Bruce Willis I've seen these in the last few days. Mm -mm. It's like some, more like Andy some, Richter. Some Astro Boy? Nice. That's cool. That was That's Andy Richter as Bruce Willis in Die Die hardish. Nice. Totoro. Easy for you to say. Nice. Where That's is sick. that from, guys? Big bada Can you boom. Tell? Um, Someone is that guess. from? Oh, I think I know. Is that from or Eureka's Castle, the movie? No, come on, guys. Golden Golden Girls. Guys, where's really, this from? Where is this really, from? Really, really, <gasps> you don't think everybody knows it's the fucking Fifth Element? I don't know. Everyone got it. Fine. Two people it has got Corbin, it. It has Corbin Dallas written on it. It's it's got the taxi cab and it says big big bada bang. And where's, it says where's this from? Where's this from? Oh, I don't. Oh, know. I know this one's Star Trek. I was gonna say um, Jurassic Park, but yeah, okay. Glasswell got it. That's Star Trek Harry Potter good. Taxi Driver. Holy shit, free kill. <laughs> <laughs> Um, 
That one is probably from Mad Max. Come on, Gat. It's so it's who oh, where is that gone. from, I, guys? Where's that go. from? Nope, it's not Batman. It's definitely Batman. It's Rocket League. Guys, come on. We're not it's, it's Rocket it's Rocket League. <laughs> it definitely is Rocket League. No, you know what? It's it's not it's, it's Blade Two. Not it's not Batman. Right, Rico, it's Blade, it's Blade <laughs> Two. Oh dude, I know that one. <laughs> Fast times at Ridgemont High. <laughs> I was gonna say Twenty One Jump Street, but that's probably it. Chips. It's Chips. That's the motorcycle they drove in Chips. I'll I recognize that anywhere. Definitely. Yeah, it's probably it's probably Gone with the Wind. Actually, <laughs> it's Rugrats. <laughs> it's from the Notebook. It looks like Chucky from Rugrats. All right. Dunk, I don't know if you're into this kind of stuff, but I'm pretty sure you are. Uh, Is it food? Bit, uh, no. No. Uh, Is it it's pocket cooler, eggs? Cooler than food. This is the San Diego Comic-Con 2018. Dun, 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 Magic the Gathering set. Drawn by really care. Therese oh. Nielsen. <laughs> We can't see it. It's a all legend, like legendary, legendary artist. You want to do a you want to do a, fly, a a drive by on the camera there? Can't see it. Can't read it. A little bit it. further away. Just a little bit further away. Yeah, perfect. Now you can you can uh, give us the slow. I'm not interested. Dun, 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 How are you not dun, interested in her dun, art? Dun, 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 can't see it. That's why. Dun, dun, and you're dun, not gonna dun, open dun, it. Dun, 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 dun. I know I'm saying Coop that I can't see it and Reggie's not gonna open it out of the damn plastic. <laughs> not today. Not damn, today. Damn plastic. Alright, we got something. We got something else. These are this is where where it gets down to the nitty gritty, as you would say. I would never say that. This is the Wu Tang Transformers vinyl toys. Are you are you gonna open it? He's opening it, guys. Are He's you doing opening it? it? Are you opening yeah. it? He's doing right, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Only, only, Why only to you this. have to open only. it in front of the camera. I just took the plastic off. It was easier for me to take the plastic off in without being the camera. So this is Killaby. Oh, thanks for the cheers, free kill. So this is Killer B. It was a set of four. Let me get to the next one. This one was one of the hardest ones to get. This one sold out first. This was Soundwave. Oh, that that could find itself. The Killer B. I'm gonna be honest with you. Wasn't like wasn't, I was like, you think it's cool? That could find a, a, a space on my on my desk for sure. This one went first. This one was the one that was sold out uh, really quick. It's Soundwave, a Wu Tang Soundwave. Are you gonna open it? Like open it, open it. Oh Hell God. no. On camera, on camera, on camera. Wait, hold Hell on. Hell no! Don't open that stuff. We're not gonna be friends anymore if you open that thing. There you go. You heard it there first <laughs> from the donk. Oh man, Ali says don't open it, but I want to open it. Yeah, because you don't I'm know how it. to. You don't know how to respect stuff, Chew. This is the Wu Tang Megatron. Nice. So here's my question: Do you think that like when like RZA and the Jizza and Old Dirty Bastard and Spec Deck and uh, Method Man and Raekwon the Chef were sitting around fucking smoking blunts and writing fucking songs about smashing people's nuts and on on top of dressers that they were like 20 years from now we're gonna have Transformer toys? <laughs> yeah. Do you, do you think that like that was like a long term yeah. goal that they had? Like I yeah, can't wait like, for us yo. to get a partnership with with Hasbro so we can get some Transformer toys out there with the yeah, Wu Tang yeah. logo on the chest. We always wanted to be a household name. Wu Tang's for the babies, for the children. <laughs> um, let's see. And then last but not least, um, we have the Wu Tang Optimus Prime. 
I'd like to see these guys, they're behind, so you might want to open one so we could, like, do a little turntable. Uh, did you not hear what, um, Ali and Donk advised? They said do not. Oh my god, everyone's saying don't open it, alright guys, alright. You hear that? That's the sound of not opening those fucking transformers, Jew. Fine, Stop trying to ruin everything. Fine. So this is the four. They're Sweet. awesome. But everyone's, now, this everyone's is... Everyone's yelling at me about not opening them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's terrible. This was my, uh, my claim to fame, this Comic-Con. Uh, this is the piece that I'm very proud that I was able to get. And it is a Robotech Puck G collaboration. That's fucking awesome. It is articulating arms. He can move his arms and his legs. This is what the schematics look like of the toy on the left, on, the, on one side. This is the back. And Are you gonna open this it? is. This is the other side. One day I will see Huck G and I will have him sign it. Uh, but another fun fact about Huck G's Robotech collaboration is this is his final solo project. He started a company with Paul Butnitz and uh, it's called Super Plastic. And they will be making all of their toys through Super Plastic from now on. This was the last mm. iteration of him doing solo Huck G designer toys without being a part of Super Plastic. Just a little fun fact. It's just a, that's a sad day in designer toy world. It is because like he did these by he he first of all Huck G made these all in America. So they um the resin they were resin not vinyl and uh he also um, you know, everybody got pay, paid fair wages and everything. Everything was great. That's why one of his, uh, that's why a lot of his toys were highly, highly expensive. Like when they first came out, cause, uh, he was, he was adamant on, uh, not having a sweatshop. Look at that. Look how cool that is. Reggie, the level of detail on these, ca on these, on these, on these toys is just ridiculous. It's pretty fucking cool. Reggie, can you show so you gonna... my dollar pins, my not my dollar buttons now? No, no, no. You can't follow this up with a dollar pin. It was asked for. Coop wants to see them. All right. Fine. If Coop wants to see it, then fine. <laughs> I just thought they All right, were cool. All right, dollar pins, dollar pins. Dollar, no, wait, I'll, I'll even turn them around. We can't see them. They're too far away. Oh, God. This is a pin. <laughs> that was a dollar. <laughs> this is another pin. Uh, that was a dollar. Uh, <laughs> this was, guess what? A dollar pin. So those are actually called buttons, for the record. This. Oh, yeah, they're buttons. It's a button that's a dollar. This is what a dollar pin button looks like right here so kids kids while you're out there uh this is an opportunity to tell you about the acme brand button maker for just 11.99 you can make your own buttons at home look at all those pins and buttons those are very buttony come on they're so cool they are i want to see you wearing like a fucking girl scout vest with all those all these pins on it <laughs> Oh, we yeah. don't have Dapper a Dapper wants to know if we got a two dollar one, <laughs> no. so we can compare the quality of the. <laughs> we can compare the quality of a two dollar button versus a three dollar. Oh yeah. How much are those buttons? Probably two dollars. Those are two dollars. You know, I got to be honest. Those, those, you know, you can see they have non-uniform silhouettes uh, showing some unique craftsmanship. Better, better packaging than the one dollar buttons. Um, it was the, the packaging was non-existent on those one dollar buttons. 